One day you're gonna like coffee, Mike. Nope. Yep. Nope. Yep. Uh uh-uh. uh. Yep. Nah uh. Yeah. Yep. Nah uh. I'm gonna I'm gonna slip it into something. Like what? I don't know. I'll randle it through a uh, my uh, butthole, like a double IPA. <laughs> oh Jesus! <laughs> you're like, why is it dark? It's a black double IPA, Mike. Just drink it. <laughs> Like, this has notes of stone fruit. This has notes of shit. <laughs> Anyways, okay, we're 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 clearly on a. Uh... <laughs> yeah, we already started the video. That was what I was going with. Yeah, I was going to include uh, it. Oh, we probably shouldn't because I'm going to talk about randomly through my butthole. <laughs> hey, Mike. What's up, Sean? I'm excited for this one. Why? Uh, one, I like apple. One, I like apple pie. Why? Ah, because it's pretty tasty. Why? Uh, I, like, I like really flaky butter requests. Fair enough. Because butter is delicious. Butter is delicious. Um, so this is, and we also love milk stouts. I love milk stouts for sure. I agree. Yeah. So this is horn swaggler, and if you're watching this, and I don't, um, fuck it's this actually baked apple pie horn swaggler. <sighs> yes, baked apple pie horn swaggler. Would right. you like read the description? Sure. Uh, chocolate milk stout conditioned with apple puree, brown sugar, milk sugar, cinnamon, and nutmeg. Tastes like an apple pie with buttery crust and a gob of chocolate Cool Whip on top. That sounds fucking insane. That sounds fucking bonkers, yeah. So Hornswoggler is the Vale's like, rotating milk stout. I've had the coffee version. They do. They have it a regular one. I think I've had a double one as well. Um, anyways, it was, it's really good. I didn't share the coffee one with Mike because... Because Mike's... He insane. hasn't realized he liked coffee yet. That's it. I'm going to kill you. In front of your parents. I was going to say something else and I forgot what it was. Don't care. Holy shit. Look at that. That can is over full. You think so? Nope. What was I going to say? I was going to say... I don't remember. Oh, this is courtesy of Larry. Oh, I know what I was going to say. I already tasted it and I smelled it. So... (laughs) But I just looked it off my fingers. Um, Yeah, courtesy of Larry... And well, that happened. if I don't mess up, this is going to be a theme week. You're going to see three Veil videos. Um, this will most likely be the second, and they're going to be bookended by Veil collabs with re- starting off is going to be um, a collaboration with Other Half and then ending it with a collaboration with Trillium. I don't know why I'm telling you this because this could totally go off the rails and you're just going to go, Sean, that's not a, that's not even how you release the videos. You're an idiot. Is there paper towels over here? Oh, is it really all over the place? No, not, not much. I do want to see if I can clean it. Oh, please. Just one little piece. Thank you. We'll do it live. I just wipe in the side of the glass. You can see, you can see the adjuncts all over the inside of the glass. But I rolled it, too. Actually, oh, I have it, too. Cool. Excellent. So, can you're going to get... Uh, this is the horn swaggler, I guess. It's a it's a goat with looks like he has a foot in his mouth. Uh, actually, uh, I would think of uh, horn swaggler. I think of horn swaggle, the wrestler. Oh yeah, the little the little dude. Oh, the yeah. little fella. Well, now we're gonna get. Now we're gonna definitely lose subscribers. <laughs> Yay! Little the little person. No? Uh, little fella's fine, right? Yeah, I guess you're right. Yeah. All right. So this is 7% and there's zero head. Zero head. It dissipated very quickly. I got a lot of bubbles to nothing very yeah. fast. It's uh, sort of a murky brown, not very attractive. Yeah, I was watching it pour and it was pouring like more royal. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's not that attractive. It's sort of like dark, dark brown. Yeah. But it said like it's leaving adjuncts all over the inside of the glass. Yeah. So, it's got a nose? Definitely. Got a little bit of coffee in that nose, sir. Almost like an espresso. I was gonna say like, almost like you get like peanut butter. A little bit, yeah. I've had peanut butter horn sauger too, but then yeah, coffee. Okay. Almost it, like a, it gets the peanut butter, oh, 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 not like peanut butter, like just like peanuts almost. That's like salty peanuts. It's sort of like um, almost a little bit like Gunner's daughter, a quick whiff of, you know. Yeah, that's a good way to put it. Yeah. And then I get a little bit of berry, but again, I've been getting berry and stouts. Yeah. For a while now, I don't know what it is. Do you get it at all? Yeah. Okay. I, I get cinnamon too. I'm not quite getting apple though. Yeah. Cinnamon nutmeg are there. But if it's apple puree, maybe it's coming gonna come in on the uh the palate. It smells really good. For seven percent, like the way the way this poured, the way that there's no head, the way that it smells, I would expect this to be a very uh, uh way higher ABV. 
Are you saying that they're lying about the ABV, Sean? <laughs> I don't. I don't see the word 450 North on here. Oh Jesus Christ! You yeah, went there. No, I don't. I just see. Uh... You went there. <laughs> okay. Goddamn, son. All right. That's what it is. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers, sir. Whoa, that's cloying. This drink's way higher than 7%. Okay. I don't think it's as cloying as, 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 as you think from the looks on your face, but that apple puree is definitely making it a... Uh, The apple definitely comes through. It's almost like it reminds me of something that's. I'm gonna let you talk. Actually, you're uh, you're making faces. I want. I, 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 I'll try. I'm this. really trying not to. Um, I'm I'm finding this to be deeply unpleasant. It's um, very sweet. It's kind of harsh. It has some very um, unpleasantly tart kind of finish in the back. Yep. I'm not getting I that. I, I wouldn't say unpleasantly, but yep, go on. I'm not. Famous. I'm not getting anything that I was getting on the nose. I'm not getting much chocolate. I'm not getting anything that is remotely um, sort of like like doughy and you know this, this says it has sort of like like buttery crust. I'm not getting any of that. And well, they never said just, buttery crust. But that's not the descriptor. Buttery crust. Oh. That's verbatim. Oh, where they get the butter? You from? fucking call me a liar. Um, yeah, honestly, I'm, I'm getting, everything I'm getting is, is pretty mostly unpleasant. I'm not, I'm not enjoying this at all. That's fair. Um, I'm enjoying it. Okay. This is a sipper for me. I'm glad we only have a can. Um, actually I have another can, but I'm glad we split this. Sounds like I'm going to be drinking Mike's. Um, and uh, it tastes I, like a way higher ABV beer. It does. It drinks way higher. The mouthfeel is, is very, it, just like it poured. It was, it poured oily. It drinks oily syrupy at the same time almost at the same time it's very it coat your mouth which i don't mind that for no i don't mind that the mouth feels fine so i i don't mean that like i'm i'm it's, i'm not calling out the mouth feel. honestly I'm, I'm 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 calling out the way it's affecting my taste buds the more i the apple comes through very nicely for me it reminds me of applesauce um you get that apple sauce, but you get a little bit more tartness. So I'm wondering what kind of apples we're using this. Like if they were red, if there there's some green apples, because usually you get that more tartness with, with, with the green apples. But I don't know. Then the cinnamon and nutmeg come in, and it almost with that, I got like right when I got the cinnamon and nutmeg there with the apple, I really believed it was like a get that apple pie taste. Chocolate. I get it sort of as an aftertaste on the back of my palate as I'm like sitting here with it. And I can feel like it feels like I just maybe had a sip of hot chocolate or had a sip or had a bite of chocolate or something like that. But front, front up, up front, I'm not really getting it. Play like let it play around with on in 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 your mouth for a bit before you swallow. No, okay, no, I like it. That's fair. Wish I did the name, the descriptors. It was it sounded yeah. great. I don't know. Maybe it needs time to. Um, this can is super, super duper fresh. This can is two eleven. So this was canned two weeks ago. Yeah, I have mean, another can. We but can... it's but it's working for you, so it's not can't be. It's just, it's it's pallets just... are pallets. Yeah, that's right. But no, I, this is not this is not something I would drink or honestly finish. Fair enough. I'll uh, I'm gonna pour this in my glass and I'll put it in the fridge and I'll drink it later. But um, <laughs> I'd be curious to know what people think about this. Um. Like I said, I'm getting a good amount of of the apple. Like it's apple, you can tell it's apple puree. You can tell like the apple sauce. I'm getting apple sauce, and then you get the nutmeg the, and the cinnamon come through. With brown sugar, not so much. It's it does have a tartness. Like the brown sugar is not there because you're not I'm not getting a sweetness. Um, but I, I like everything that that's going on with it. The lactose, since the milk stout, not really getting that sweetness either. But I'm enjoying what it is, and for seven percent, it's drinking higher than it is. So you kind of doing the placebo effect of, oh, I'm drinking a bigger beer, but um, 
I enjoy it. I don't think if I had to, th- and I had it like probably two years ago, thinking back on the um, the coffee or the or the peanut butter I had, Horns Wagler, I'm not sure I enjoy it as much as that. Um, but I think I'm getting kind of what it says on the can, minus like the brown sugar, and not the buttery crust. I don't even know if you'd want to get buttery crust in like a, a beer at that point. I, I definitely would like to, to get like a doughiness. That would be nice. Yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, um, let us know in the comments um, if, if you've had the Big Depple Pie Horn Swaggler and what you think of it. Do you agree with me? Do you agree with Mike? Are you in the middle? Um, what's your favorite variant of Horn Swaggler? And uh, yeah, just have a conversation. Any final thoughts? Yeah. I, I wish I liked it, but I don't. Uh, my bad. You no, know, it's not your bad. Yeah. It is what it is. Um, and nerdsense.net, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, if those are your things, and hit the notification bell. Bing, bing. And uh, I'm Sean. I'm Mike. And this, this is Nerd Sense. Nerd Sense.